Since September of 2023, In Times Like These has captivated its loyal viewers. Here is how In Times Like These will captivate you. This drama revolves around six families in the fictional town of Valley Park, Florida. The families are the Dorvals, Russos, Torres, Mitchells, Burks, and Franklins. The theme of this series is the old rich going against the new rich, going against those who are trying to make it in this world. It explores what makes us all different, such as generational differences, cultural backgrounds, religious beliefs, and economic backgrounds. In Times Like These is a character-driven series where the characters' reactions determine where the story goes. Since the characters are problematic, it provides this series with messy drama. Since episodes are uploaded every Monday to Friday, the storylines won't be rushed. Most of all, there are no season finales. This allows viewers to know these characters on a deeper level. The storylines will be packed with high stakes, but in order to reach those high stakes, the stories need to grow gradually. Since every episode and dialogue will drive story, there will be no filler episodes. Though this series can't please everyone, your thoughts on the series matter and will always be taken into consideration. Because this series is shown year round, you get to celebrate holidays with these characters. But remember, this is in times like these, not Hallmark. Holiday episodes are not warm and cozy. Holiday episodes are messy. Whenever in times like these reaches milestones, like anniversaries, the anniversary episodes will be insane. The anniversary episodes will remind you why you started watching the series in the first place. Realism is very important to this series. Because of that, there will be no ghosts or vampires. Kids will not rapidly age, and there won't be mad scientists trying to take over the world. Even though there will be insane stories, in times like these is not a fantasy or sci-fi series. If you see a character's dead body, then they are not coming back. This series is based on absolute truth. Good is good, evil is evil. Good characters might do something evil, and evil characters might do something for a good reason. But good is still good, and evil is still evil. In times like these will be packed with cautionary tales. The hope is to see viewers learn something and grow as people. But it will not be preachy. Each character has their own beliefs. So this series will not force viewers to think a certain way. The plan is to challenge the viewer's worldview. Since the goal is to see this series last for years, episodes are intended to be better than the last. In times like these, we'll tackle current event issues to remain relevant for years to come and to offer character development. Since in times like these shouldn't lose its identity, this series offers an open door to revisit and expand upon the series past. If you're late to the party, then that's okay. Either you can watch from the first episode, hop onto the most recent episode, or check out the weekly recaps. You're not ready for what's to come, but tune in anyway. Please make sure to like, comment, share, and subscribe.